Hello guys, welcome to Dance IT Network. On my previous video, we create a uh, four subnetted networks, okay? But we only need uh, three networks, which is the network one, network two, and network three, okay? And it's time for us now to apply the uh, their IP addresses, okay? So on the network one, we'll be on this uh, portion, okay? We'll be using this default gateway, the 1.1 to this router, and this PC, okay, will get this IP address, the uh, 1.2, all right? And the uh, network 2 will apply it over here, okay? As showed on the label, the uh, IP router 1 should get the uh, IP address 1.65, which is here, okay? And the router 2, the uh, 1.66. And lastly, the network 3, okay, the uh, 1.129 uh, will be on the uh, this um, router, okay, the uh, default gateway, and then uh, the PC, all right, well, this should be a PC2, okay, I'll change it, all right, and this PC2, it should get the uh, 1.130, okay, and we need to use the subnet mask 255.255.255.192 on the each IP um, address that uh, will go into register, okay, why? It's because um, they were submitted, all right, into a slash uh, 26 um, network, okay? And let's proceed. Let's register their IP addresses. Let's start first with this PC. Oh, IP configuration, all right? Well, I already uh, put uh, the IP address in here, all right? You notice that this is the uh, 1.2 and subnet mask, the... Uh, uh, 255.255.255.192 and the uh, default gateway should be the uh, router's IP address, okay, which is on this gigabit 0 slash 0, the uh, 1.1, all right, and it's good. I'll close this and I'll go to the uh, router 1, command line interface, hit no, and then hit enter to get started, type enable to go to the privilege mode, and then comp T to go to the global config mode. And let's go to the uh, um, interface 00 slash 1 slash 0. <clears throat> okay. 0 slash 1 slash 0. And uh, since this is uh, the uh, DCE port, all right, we need to set the uh, clock rate. Okay. So type here clock rate, which is 128,000. And then I'll give it an IP address, 192.168.1.65, okay? And then space, 255.255.255.192, okay? So this is the uh, .65, right? It's the router one, okay? It's correct. And then I'll hit and turn this, and then I'll type here, no shutdown to turn on the interface, okay? Right. And uh, it's good. And I'm also gonna um, give this um, gigabit zero slash uh, zero an IP address, okay? Which should be the uh, default gateway of this uh, PC, the uh, 192.168.1.1, okay? Let's proceed. Interface gigabit zero slash zero. IP address 192.168.1.1 space, okay? Um, 255.255.255.192, okay? And type here, no shutdown to turn on the interface. And let's save the configuration by typing do right, okay? And it's good. I'm close this. And then let's proceed to the router two. Let's command line interface, okay? And I'll say no in here. And hit enter to get started, enable, go to the privilege mode, and then comp T to go to the global config mode. And let's proceed first on the interface serial 0 slash 1 slash 0. Okay, it's correct. Okay, and it should get the IP address, the uh, 1.66. Okay, well, this is a, a DTE port. Well, we don't need to configure a clock rate, all right, because it's a DTE. I'll hit enter on this. I'll give it an IP address, 
255.1.66 and then um, space the subnet mask should be 255.255.255.192 okay and I'll type here no shutdown to turn on the interface here we go and let's proceed onto the next interface um, gigabit zero slash zero all right and the IP address on this uh, network three is the router okay it should get the uh, one dot one twenty nine okay all right all right so IP address 192.168.1.129 space 255.255.255.192 okay and then um, no shutdown to turn on the interface all right and let's save the uh, configuration there we go all right and i'll close this let's proceed onto the uh, pc2 okay and desktop IP configuration, this should get the uh, 1.130, okay? All right, so 192.168.1.130. Subnet mask, this should be, I'll change the 0 to 192. And then the default gateway should be the IP address on this router, okay? Which is residing on the uh, gigabit 0 slash 0. Okay, and it's the uh, 1.129, okay? All right, 192.168.1.129, okay? All right, and I'll close this. There we go. So now that all of the uh, IP um, addresses are registered on all of the uh, devices, all right? Well, let's try to uh, ping, okay? I'll, let's say I want to ping from this PC to this PC too. I'll do that command prompt and a ping all right uh, IP address in this PC is the uh, 1.129 right okay so ping 192.168.1.129 and you see that uh, it's a destination host unreachable okay yeah that is true it's because on this router all right it knows about this network it knows about this network, but it doesn't know about this network because it's not connected on its uh, serial or its interface, all right? It's not. Same as on this router, it knows about this network and this network, but it doesn't know about this network, okay? Because this is not connected on the uh, interfaces of this router, all right? That is why it's not working. So on my next tutorial, we'll configure the... Uh, um, static, all right? Static route or the uh, default route, okay?